Hello, 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 and welcome to Bad Mouse Gaming. I'm your host, Dave, aka Bad Mouse, and we are back in Ultimate Fishing Simulator 2 Early Access. This game was just um, put out on Steam here recently. Link is down below. And can be picked up. I believe it's 10 or 15% off right now. So it's a pretty good deal. And this game has a lot. It, it, it seems to be um, impressing me a little bit here and there. So I did a little bit off camera. And I'm almost up to um, level 3. And we haven't done anything with trying to keep the fish. There's a couple of reasons why, but before we get started, let me um, remind everybody, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please click that subscribe button down there. It does mean an awful lot to me. And um, leave a comment, let me know what you guys think of this video, and for sure, click them like buttons. Let's jump in here, let's talk about Ultimate Fishing Simulator. Yeah. All right, so I have been going for the most amount of XP points, so I haven't been keeping any of my fish. Plus, I'm not getting a lot of money for the fish that I'm catching at this level. But if we open up our fishing net, you can see I do have a couple in here. We could sell them. Or we could have put them in our tanks at the resident or hung them on the wall. Now, the thing with the residence thing is... If you're going to keep your fish, I guess I would hang mine on the wall before anything else in this early stage of the game. Simply because... I think my fish is over... 1 of 10, yeah. My little fish there, if we click on it... Needs to be fed. Well, I don't know if it needs to be fed. But... You do need to feed it. And we can feed it. There on uh, right mouse button to feed fish. There comes down the worm. And he eats it. And he's got a little bit here. I don't know. Do they die if you don't feed them? Or is that just something to waste your worms on? I need those worms to fish with. So in all this, he's the only fish I have in here. Everything else is still empty. No boards or trophies or anything like that. Alright, so we are ready to go fishing. I'm not buying anything new or anything like that. But I really want to check out a different lake. But that's what level 3 is required for. So today's video is going to be this lake. We just got to catch one or two more fish to reach that level 3. So let's go back over to Jackson County. And let's go fishing. All right, so this map has been updated. It has been updated. They changed a few things. And if we look here, you can see we have a new area here, area six. That's where we are at now. We explored all the other areas in the last video, the first video. But um, yeah, let's check out area six here. Let's go over to our spinning rod. I did upgrade my line. Because I was losing some fish. My bobber has the um, same line now. Well, my spinner now has the same line as my bobber. My bobbin fishing had a tougher line for some reason. Let's go underwater. Alright, slow down to speed to 10%. And start to bring it in. There it goes. Oh, slack in the line there. So are we heading anywhere good? Oh, yeah. Some nice underwater terrain here. We need a big one. I've gotten a couple trying to get up to this level and um, some of them really put up a good fight like this one here he's putting up a pretty good fight oh yeah he's in the red 
I probably would have broke my line already if I hadn't upgraded it. We'll give him a second here. So I think they're supposed to have upgraded the fish being tired out also. I guess they weren't getting tired out before. Oy. Bring him in. Oh, he's really fighting it here. If I put the drag up anymore. Let me try it. We could try 46. Let's see if that helps. Uh, see how much more in the red we are now? Like, I'm really afraid to have my drag up that high. Because I think he's going to break my line. All right, let's bring him in. He's out there another couple meters. So I'm using my right click to pull my rod back. And then as my rod goes down, I try to reel it in real fast. So we don't lose any ground. I can reel while I pull. But I gotta watch that tension. Don't want to get in that red. Man, he's just... We're just dead even here. He's coming and going. He's not giving or going. Let's move that up just a little bit. I moved the drag up just a little bit to 42%. Yeah, uh, no. He's still pulling on us. I guess we just got to see if we can tire him out. Let's flip under water real quick. Yeah, he's really fighting. He's pulling it. Just can't get past that 20 there. Every time I get him down to 19, he pulls it back out to 20. Do we have to bring our drag up just a little bit more? I think we're going to have to. I don't know. He's wearing down. Got him at 16. 15. Yeah, I think we could probably move that drag up a little bit more. Yeah, yeah, now we're pulling him up out of the water a little bit. I think we got him. I think we got him. Come on. There he is. But look at him. There's the right click. All right. Look at that. Rainbow trout. Almost two kilograms. That's a lot of experience points. 26 if we keep them. 38 if we let them go. Ooh. Four dollars. We'll keep this one. That wasn't quite enough to get me my... Oh, we're so close. We're so close. Alright, let's do this again. Doing pretty good with this collar. I was using a white one in level two and I just couldn't get these big ones. But when I switched over to this yellow one here, why isn't it spinning? We are reeling. Oh, we got a fish on there. Missed that. Hey, he's not a fighter. 
He'll just come straight in on us. But it might be enough to get us to level 3. Five points. There it is. Thumbs up, everybody. Thumbs up, everybody. We are moving to a new lake. All right, exit location. Now, let's check out this one. The Lassie. $50. Holiday Resort is located on the shores of Lake Gilwa, also called Reniskansky. I don't know. It lies about 20 kilometers west of, um, I, ain't, I don't know, and about 30 kilometers northeast of Astrod, Astroda. A small unnamed water course flows into from the east. French, European perch. Oh, these are um, some of the fish we're going to catch. Common carp. Oh, there's all kinds of different carp. There's some pike. Let's buy a license and let's go fishing. All right, here we are on our brand new lake. Oh, we got water on both sides of us here. What is this over here? There's a bright rock. What's the map look like? Wow, look at all that water. So we have five areas to explore here. Which is really a lot more than that. We got one, two, three, four, five, because we got both sides here. Six. So we got six areas that we're going to explore here. All right. Well, let's just start off with number one. And I believe that's where we are at now. We have a little landing here we can get on. This is perfectly safe. I don't know. My mouth seems to be. Really swingish. I love this scenery. So realistic. Peaceful. Alright, let's try bobbin fishing here. Alright, let's bring our bobber up. Alright, we're under a meter there. Let's pop it out there and see what happens. Oh, there's a duck over there. That looks like a good height. There goes that duck. There we got him. There we got him. It looks like we got our first carp here. So this drag is set at 58%. That's the default. I haven't tweaked this one at all. Oh, I lost him. I didn't even realize I lost him. Maybe there was an issue with me setting the hook. Is 
Looks like we're gonna get another try here at the same fish. He's eyeballing it. I see him. Oh, oh we got it looks like a catfish. There we're gonna set that hook again. Do we still have him? No. Alright, as soon as they strike, I'm gonna go out of camera range to make sure that hook is being set. There he is down there. Oh, did we get him? Yes, now we got him. Oh, he's a strong one. Come on. We got you. Everything's gonna be okay. You'll love it where you're going. Maybe I'll mount these ones on my walls. Yeah. Alright. These are all ours. Suzanne Carp. He weighs a lot, but he's not giving a lot. I'm not going to keep any carp. Alright. Let's try over this way. Got a way over there. I'm not seeing any fish over here. I want to make sure I keep that line tight. There we go. Oh, yes. Yes. Yep, we got that one. He's a fighter, too. He's a fighter. Oh, he's going to break the line. He's going to break the line. Oh, there it did it. Oh, he was too big for what I got. And I think I needed level. Let me see here. Lines. I think, yeah, we are using the 1.3. But in order to get something a little bit higher, see, they're shaded out. Oh, I was able to purchase that one now. I don't think I was able to purchase before because I didn't have the the right level. So what did we just buy? What did we just buy? Equipment. One forty three. All right, let's try using that and see if that helps us out. A little bit tougher line. That's incomplete. Oh, that's set one, set two. So we got that stronger line, but it knocked our bait off. Oh. All right. Now we got it all set back up. Look at that pike down there. Think we'll get a hold of him? Oh 
watching him. There he goes. Is he gonna come back? He'll definitely put that new line to the test. Nope, we're gonna get something else. Seem like we're in a very good hole here. Let's go more closer towards over here and see if we can't get something to notice us. Oh, we noticed got something kind of big. Not coming in real fast. He's really pulling hard. But he is coming in. Yeah, he's all mine now. bit bigger than I thought it was. Put that under the keep. Alright, let's move to another spot here. Go over to number two. This is pretty over here. I like this. I like this. We'll try one more bobber and then we'll go back to the lure. Uh, it looks like this might need uh, the worm to be set a little bit deeper. Although there is some fish there I see towards the surface. But they're kind of further away from where I'm at. Yeah, I'm in that direction. Well, I don't know, I'm kind of getting over in that way. See if something comes over this way. Here comes something. We got him. Well, he's a pretty good sized one. I'd take that home and eat it. Alright, let's try this pool over here. Really getting that good spin on it. There, it's starting to spin up. Oh yes, something hit that hard. Need to speed up our reel here. That's the only kind of thing I'm not really liking about this game is I have to roll my wheel to move the speed up and down. 
Maybe they could have used E and Q for that or something. ASP. I have no idea what that is. I like the way this one kind of sinks down pretty low. I want to look something really big over here. Water seems kind of deep. Or river. Oh, there's something. I don't know what that was. European perch. Hardly no points at all. Alright, let's go check out these two sides here. I'm more curious about this side. See what's over in there. I think we're looking at... I guess they kind of look the same on both sides. We do have a little landing over here. That's kind of nice. Is that where we were? No, no. We're looking at, we're looking at this over here. All right, so we're in a good spot here. There went a fish. Oh, there he is. Got another one of those perch. He's a little bit more bigger. Not by much, though. New record. He's worth one more point than the last one. Alright, let's try, um... Let's try this one in here. See if we track something else. I didn't see where that landed. Need the duck gun up there. That's a big guy. But he's ignoring the pink lure altogether though. Light the pink. Oh, but he did. He's coming right in here. He's gonna bring himself home. Oh, he's gonna try to break it. Oh, my drag was too high. How did that happen? Oh, 
Oh. Yeah. We need to go back and buy one of those. Yeah, we could probably buy something new now. That we are up there. I'd like to try something like that. This is something I use in real life. I like those. It's, but I like the little rooster tail ones. It's got the feathers. The black or the red and um. The red and yellow coming off of it. I'm going to try this one. And then. I would like to try a spoon too. Nice top waters. I haven't seen any water really good for that top water. Hmm. I want to try this one. $54. Alright. So equipment. We're going to go with this one first. Speed down. Not really getting a spin on that little spoon. It'll spin if I pull back on the pole, but I don't know why it's not. Maybe it needs a little bit more speed. I don't know, I'm reeling it in. I just ain't getting a spin on there. Like it doesn't really feel a pull. If I lift my rod up, it'll work. I know, something... Something just didn't feel right. See, look, I got all that slack. I'm thinking maybe this has got to have a faster pull. 34 might be too much. 20 is too much. Maybe it's just too close to me now. Let's try it one more time here. Just can't get that good spin on it like I know it's supposed to have. Is it because the current's going with me? If I make it too fast, it raises it too high. Alright, so I'm going to try... Going in this direction, seeing if I get a spin. Maybe it's the current. I just don't get it. All right, maybe it's just this waterway. Try this guy out. I picture it being bigger than that. All right.
This was the $54 one. Nice little wiggle to it. Let's see if we pick up anything on it. This might be just the wrong, wrong type of water, wrong type of fish for these lures, but they should still work. All right, so I'm getting nothing. We're going to switch over to the bobber. All right. There's my bobber. And we're going to catch something here. Let's try to do a short cast over here. That didn't go very far. That's a little bit further. But is there any fish here? All right, let's go over here and look at this side. This is like a little river over here. Yeah. Definitely want to use a short cast here. Ah, uh, I reeled in just a hair. I can't get it. Feel that line? That is too close. All right, so we'll do it that way.
Oh, he got one. Oh, he, he's a strong one, too. Oh, don't, don't, don't. Turn the drag down. Oh, why was that drag up so high? I tried to turn the drag down. So there's some pretty good fish in here. Does it automatically choose the worm? No, we have to pick a worm. Probably have to go buy a worm. Well, we've got different kinds of bait here. Got some nice bait here. We get dragonflies? Nope. Let's go back up. Let's try some grubs. Oh. Cicadas. Yeah, let's get the cicadas. Hi. Alright. Equipment. Eight. Wait a minute, what's going on here? Why can't I select the, um... Because I didn't choose a hook. So we still had some worms. But we're going to use these. And then I do know I want to bring my fiber down a little bit more. Alright. Let's see if we can't catch something now. It seems like a good spot. Get a little bit further out here, just a hair. I do have my line quite deep. Probably too deep. Yeah, I'm thinking my lines. Oh, wait, wait. Somebody's checking out the merchandise. Well, there's some big, big fish down here. I'm a little bit scared to hook one of them up. It doesn't seem like they're after the cicada fly. Not at all. Alright, so this is what we're going to do. We're going to see if I can't buy a little bit stronger. Don't use a lure. And I want to get a little bit stronger tension line here. I've seen some really big guys down there. Do we do the 220? Or the 320? Go to 360? Nope. Alright, we can do the 320.
All right, let's see how this works out. I just feel like that's not fast enough. Where was them big guys at? Oh, look at there. Somebody's eyeballing it. Looks yummy. They're not taking the bait. All right, let's try, um, let's go back. Alright, let's go back and let's try the white one. What do you think, folks? Think they'll go for the white one? Something did. Oh, yeah, we hooked him. Oh, he's pulling that tension out hard, too. It's something big out there. Got a monster pike on there, I think. Come to me. He's swimming this way, which is making it easy for me. Oh, he decided to turn around, but no, I got him. $17. Yeah, I think we'll keep that. We need to rebuild our bank a little bit. We are not even close to level four. All right, so we're done in this area. Let's move over here. Four. Go fish off this dock over here. This one's got a chair. Almost didn't see it. It was camouflaged. Slow it down. I need to look at the store and see if the mother lures has got different speeds or something. Let's see what I'm doing wrong with them. They're definitely not spinning like they're supposed to. a lot of wildlife down here looking kind of barren oh we definitely hit something there he's a strong one too really strong 
It's gonna be my money maker right here. Yeah, he's coming in. Not liking it, but that new that new line I think is helping me out tremendously. Wow. That, yeah, it is my personal best. Two kilograms. Uh, we're gonna keep need money. Money, money, money. All right, let me look here. Did they don't tell you anything about having to be at a certain speed or anything? Not at all. So I'm wondering why my spinners and stuff aren't really spinning. Uh, let's try this one more time here. We haven't caught anything on these spinners. Or that spoon. See, when I lift it up on it, see how fast that spins? That should be the way it should be spinning. Move the speed up a little bit. My little fish at the top says it's green. Well, I guess it's doing a good job. About to break out a camera here because we're getting to the surface. Alright, let's go let's go out this way. If I slow it down to 10, it's no longer green. If I move it up to 22... Not showing... Oh! You want to be on top of the water, right? No? Maybe we gotta let it sink? I'm not understanding... What the fuck is wrong with this guy? A 14. A 10, nothing. At 22, I get a green. At 26 to green, still green, yes. So it looks like 22 is going to be my number. No, we have to let it sink.
I don't know. I don't know. Alright, let me look here. Let's try over here. Alright, so our speed is at 22%. I got a green fish over there. That must be the right speed. Oh, I thought I had something there. Oh, I did! Oh, yes, and we got him. Beat that up. Oh, no. Beat that up. Throw you down. Easy cow. Trying to kill me here. Oh, he's pulling hard. Oh, he's pulling hard. Even with me reeling, he's still pulling out. There, we got him coming in a little bit. I want to break my pole. I think the poles can break too, maybe. We need to upgrade the poles. We need to upgrade the reels. Oh, look at He's pulling it all the way back out. Right back out where he was to begin with. We need to move our try 42%. See if that's too much on the line. This is a new line, so I could probably keep my drag up a little bit higher. Yeah, we're not getting close to the red line at all. And he's pulling back out again. 46% Oh, this is my biggest fish yet. It's got to be. Yeah, he's all the way out there. 33, 34. Oh, he's starting to come back in now. Here he comes. Decided to swim right towards me. Must have got a little tired there. Alright, I think at 46% drag, we're kind of even matched here. Except for I'm pulling a little bit more than he is. Normally when you get them to the surface like that, it's easy to pull them in. Ah. Pull back out before I can get him up. There he is. Wow, look at that. I get a cinematic for that one. ASP. I don't know what an ASP is. That's kind of cool. A little cinematic there. Now, what happens if I click keep? No. No cinematic for that, though. Alright. We're about halfway into... The... Um, what do you call it? Number four. Level 4 on our skill tree here. So, we did pretty good with that. Let's see if we can't get that spoon to work now. I, that was a big fish.
All right, so we're gonna take this down to 22, or is it 26? Well, at 26 is giving me a green over there. So it must be a good speed. Except for it's coming to the surface too fast. Let's try 22. See if I still get green. Yeah, I still get a green, but still pulling it up. Maybe I gotta put my rod down low before I go into camera mode. You think that matters? Whether it was up or down? Let's try that. Alright, let's put a rod down low. Then we'll go into camera mode. Let's move that up to 26. Yeah, that's much better. Not drawing any attention now. Seeing some big fish down there, though. All right, I'll move this back down to eighteen. Let's see if that flashes green. Yeah, yeah, I'm getting green on 18, all right, barely. I think we do have to go up to 20. There we go. So this just might not be the right kind of water for this type of lure though. Yeah, I don't think that's the right kind of lure for this type of water. We need faster moving water. Um, uh, let's change it to out. Let's try... This one again. Lower our thing down to 10%. These really work out pretty good. That's what fishing is. Trying out different things. One day something might work great. Next day you might not get nothing and something else was working great. Depends on the sun, the color of your lures, your spinners, time of day, whether it's hot out. seems to be going too slow. I wonder if something changed in one of the updates. Cause see, I'm not even getting a good spin on that. I'm bringing it in, but there ain't no spin. But if I pull my rod, no, not even if I pull my rod. Oh! Oh, he's gonna fight me. Can't fight too good though.
There's that ASP, but it's not a new record. So we'll keep. Because we want to sell those. Try to replenish our bank account here a little bit. Um. Oh, we kept quite a bit here. So we got $25. And we're almost back up to half of what we started with. We started with 200. Um, I'd like to get a little bit further up before I try any tournaments. Daily tournaments. That's kind of cool. You can create your own tournaments. I like that. That's really cool. But I think this is where we're going to leave this episode. Um, I've been recording now for over an hour. And it's been a lot of fun. Time flies when you're playing this Ultimate Fishing Simulator 2. Uh, leave a comment down below. Let me know what you guys think of these types of videos. And of course, click them like buttons. Thanks for watching. We'll see you guys next turn.